Welcome back to the U.S. Plastic Corps Allen County Preview Show. Our attention now turns to the Northwest Conference, where six of the eight schools had 500 better records last year. Pacing the way, Delphus Jefferson, who won their third straight league crown, 15th in school history. The Jeff Cats looking to keep that tradition at the top. I think it says a lot about our kids. It says a lot about the players that we have here. You know, um, um, each year it's different players, but they, they really do keep that same mentality of, of they want to win. And, um, you know, it just doesn't happen. They work very hard uh, in the off season and, and, and preparing here through camp in two days. And, you know, we've seen that same thing. So we have a very good senior class, great leadership, um, a team that's been a part of a, of a good winning tradition. And I think they've really brought that same chemistry into our team right now. Jeff Katz outscored opponents 38 to nine last year, and they return 1,100 plus yard rusher Hunter Binkley, as well as 600 yard man Brennan Auer. It definitely makes me confident with those guys behind me. Um, Hunter Binkley's a great running back and Brennan Hour is too, and it just makes things a lot easier when you got guys like that to hand it off to. It's nice. It's nice having your skill guys back, you know, with, with Jace and, and, and Hunter, who have been a part of the offense for three years, and Brennan Hour for two years at the other running back spot. Um, but, you know, we have some young guys, though, too, that will be juniors and seniors now that that uh, maybe uh, sat behind a really good senior class, but got some good experience, you know, learned some good lessons from that senior class and uh, have a good grasp on our offense. And another big Delphus line up front paving the way. Yeah, the line is pretty big. I think they're the best line to come through here in a little while. So we're looking forward to this season. They're coming along nicely. Uh, it seems like every year we have to, we deal with that here, the same thing about new line, but each year they get it done. Our coaches on the line do a great job and. It shows on Friday nights. It makes you feel good. That's the one thing I think we're blessed to have is some size. And, um, you know, uh, each team's differently. I've seen, you know, really good teams up front that have smaller guys. We feel like our, our line's going to be big. And, um, again, a number of these guys played at the JV level last year, but they've shown great potential. So uh, we feel like we can be good on both the offense side of the ball with the line and the defense side of the ball with the line. So I think there'll be two good strengths for us. Another strengths, the character that Coach Chris Summers and his staff have built into the program. In fact, they invited the Northwest Conference football teams to a Woodlawn movie night two days before two a days began. I've done some things as a coach that I've really enjoyed that that definitely sits up at the top of the list because you, you know, you, you see these guys, you get to know them a little bit, I guess through just scouting them and, and playing against them, but actually get to talk to them. That was a lot of fun. And um, you know, our, our, our league's a great league. These other, these other schools, the other teams, they have great kids. And I got to meet quite a few of them there uh, at our movie nights experience, I'll remember.